So a personal insolvency practitioner is a regulated person by the Insolvency Service of Ireland to deal with people who have debt problems uh, and they can range from unsecured debts like credit union loans, uh, personal loans with banks and of course mortgages where they're unsustainable and they're in arrears with their debts. So a PIP or a personal insolvency practitioner is a licensed and authorised individual who specialises in dealing with people who are in debt, so debt such as mortgage arrears, short term debt, long term debt. Um, we are in place to put in long term solutions for clients who come to us in relation to their mortgages or other unsecured debts that they may have. So I suppose the majority of people that would come to us would be in some sort of mortgage arrears or some sort of difficulty with their mortgage. When somebody comes into my office, they're usually very stressed. They have mortgage arrears. They're worried they're going to lose their family home. And I, I assure them that there is a process. There is a solution to their problems, to their financial problems. To be insolvent, I suppose the, the major definition is that as your bills fall due, so as your bills come in the door, you're not able to pay them. So you find yourself paying piecemeal payments off bills, you find maybe that you're paying bills late, that you're sacrificing certain things to pay bills, or that you're not paying them at all. So if any of those scenarios apply to you, the chances are that you probably would be insolvent and one of the solutions um, is available for you. So if you can't make payments on your loans to your creditors and you're doing restructured uh, arrangements, you don't have enough money every month to meet your financial commitments, you can declare yourself insolvent. So people are very, very stressed when they come in and usually it's, it's, it's just probably the most worrying time in a person's life. It's a huge worry for people, um, especially if they have families, they have young children, um, if they are in difficulty paying their mortgages, especially if a creditor, a mortgage provider or a bank, they've taken some legal action against them. That's when the intense worry starts to set in. People are then at risk of losing their homes. The first thing we would do is invite you to come to a meeting in the office with us. Um, we would generally, people would generally contact us by telephone or email initially. We would ask them to bring any evidence that they have with them of the difficulties that they've been having with their debts. So sometimes it's letters and um, in, in oftentimes emails and things like that that they've received from creditors. When they come in, we would go through all of that information with them. Um, we would go through what their, their main concern is. So we were speaking about mortgage arrears in scenarios like that. The main worry that people have is the retention or the keeping of their family home. I think people don't initially believe from us that we can come up with a solution to solve their problems. They think that, you know, they've tried everything themselves. They may have been to a solicitor, they may have been to somebody else and they ended up coming to us as a last resort. They've just heard about us and they believe that it's, there's nothing else available to them. It's a fresh start for clients. When they come to us, they are at the lowest ebb of their life. We're able to relieve that stress. We're able to relieve the debt issues that they're having. And we have been told by some of our clients that it is like coming up for fresh air. But even through the arrangement, they have what's recognised as a reasonable standard of living. They're looked after first, their families are looked after first, their mortgage payments are prioritised. And that actually, they actually find they're living, they're having a higher standard of living than they were previous to contacting a practitioner or getting involved in one of the insolvency scenarios.